Hello everyone. Hi all. Thanks for joining us for this epilogue episode of our The Monster Without a Plan series. Yeah, we plan on making this the final, final episode. Well, we never say never. We have no plans to make anything else, do we? Not on Chris Watts. No. Unless something else happens in the case. This is it. Um, but we just wanted to make this video to uh, basically close this off with the little cherry on the top that we have re-edited. Some of you have seen it, haven't they? They have, but they'll see a different one. It's kind of a slightly different version of it. We're going to, we're going to re-upload Orion um, through this. So um, if you want to watch Orion, timestamp is below or on the screen now. Uh, so when we did the first one, we'd already made what? Maybe about 250 videos, hadn't we? Yeah. For another platform, though. No. Well, other platforms. So we were no stranger to, to video cre creation content. Although, admittedly, most of the stuff we had done were reaction videos, which weren't really too challenging in terms of editing, but... Hardly anyone watches reaction videos to things like that. N not to what we were doing. I mean, we started off with, with innocuous stuff, didn't we, like... Um, fails, reacting to fails and news bloopers and news bloopers and stuff like that. And then YouTube started removing them for some, for various reasons. Uh, it wasn't anything to do with copyright. They just we got one removed because we had the word words "Oh my god" in the thumbnail, didn't we? Yeah. So we they were just being removed for stupid reasons. So um, we decided to um, knock YouTube on the head. Uh, we went over to another platform that will remain nameless. We spent eight months there. We built up a reasonable following there, didn't we? Yeah. But it was a site full of, um, let's say, alternative theories as to what was going on then and what is going on now. Yeah. And we started making content that kind of tailored to those things. We went down a very deep rabbit hole, didn't we, both Ooh, of us? Oh, very, very deep. Yeah. And it all almost cost us both our sanity, didn't it? It did. Uh, so we decided, after really li nearly losing our minds doing this stuff, that we had to get our heads out of the rabbit hole. And we did, didn't we? We did. We got some air, we regrouped, and we thought about the type of content that we really wanted to do, that we wanted to do when we first joined YouTube, but didn't really have the Much. capability of. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, Shaz always wanted to do a true crime video, so you started off, you did... Um, I did... Um, Jeffrey Dahmer. Je Jeffrey Dahmer and then uh, Dennis Nielsen. And Dennis Nielsen, which weren't, you know, you, you didn't get a whole hell of a lot of views, did you, on those two videos? No. Um, but then we, um, during lockdown, I think it was the first lockdown, wasn't it? Yeah. We... I think we'd seen it before. That was the JCS video, but we we'd already knew about the Chris Watts because we started basically following it kind of the night of the fifteenth, basically the morning of the sixteenth. Yeah, we did. That's when the news flashed around the world that this woman and her two children had gone, gone. missing in Colorado. Yeah. Um. So we followed that case and we we kind of felt bad for chris until we saw the news interviews and we were like there's something, something wrong there, wrong there. Yeah. something's definitely not right really wrong and then there was no surprise to learn i think it was the morning of the 17th wasn't it yeah that he'd been arrested so that wasn't really a surprise but we just thought what an absolute scumbag and then just getting back to what we were saying during the first lockdown We'd already seen the JCS video, but we wanted to make our own, didn't we? Yeah, we did. So uh, We thought we'll do it together and we'll try and do commentary. On it. On what we see versus, you know, what's on the screen and what our opinions are. We made a lot of mistakes in the first one, didn't we? <laughs> well, yeah, we didn't have what we... We didn't have all the info that we needed. No, we, we, we did kind of... Our modus operandi, for those of you who know our channel and know what we do and have seen our videos, is we basically go into most of this stuff cold, don't we? Yeah, we do. And we, you, when we watch it and you're watching it with us, we are watching it for the very first time, aren't we? We are. 
So, so a lot of the Chris Watt stuff we were watching for the first time, we'd seen some of it. Obviously, the interviews. Yeah, the interviews we had seen. And on... the in- some of the interrogation and the polygraph, but not all of it. No, not all of it. So a lot of it was new to us. So by the time episode one ended, we knew there was more to do. So we said, well, the- there'll be at least an episode two. And then when episode two finished, during the making of episode two, we saw the sheer amount of... Footage. footage that was available for it so we thought well in for a penny in for a pound so we thought we would cover it all we got up to we always said we would stop when he had the cuff slapped on him and he was taken in the back of a police car that is when we would end it we did that we uploaded orion we as did. well yeah. as kind of our musical chronicle not just of the case but of what a wonderful mother wife sister daughter Shanam was and those two adorable yeah. kids and Nico as well exactly so we made that and then we stepped away but we had so many people saying please go and do the interview please go and do the prison interview didn't we yeah so many comments we had so many people requesting it so we decided what the hell we 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 promised pretty early on I think in the comments of part 12 uh, part 11 rather that's when we we um paused we said to oh, we said in the comments, okay, at some point we will go and do the prison interview. Um, basically, you heard um, parts 12, 13, and 14, went through the whole thing. Yeah. We're stopping now. We're done with it. Yeah, we're putting it to bed. Yeah, yeah, and we're glad to be rid of him, aren't we? Because... Well, we've spent too much time on him. Yeah. Because he's... He, 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 he ain't worth it. He's a worthless mushroom polisher as far as I'm concerned. He's worse than that. Yeah. Um, we are glad to be rid of him. We we are very grateful um, for all of you for finding us through this series. So thank you very much. Yeah, thank you very much, everyone. And uh, please leave us a comment on this video. Let us know what you've thought of this series. Let us know where we could have, you know what we could have done better what we could have done differently what we could have changed yeah any parts that you liked in particular any episodes let us know what your favorite episode was yeah or you know when i say favorite episode the one that was most informative or the one that you got the most out of yeah um but what we're going to do now is we're going to present to you our musical chronicle of the case which is orion orion recorded by metallica on their master of puppets album to be honest with you, they got such a bad rep over this case, didn't they? With the use of battery, with the mention of battery. Yeah, I don't understand that. Well, you know, it's not Metallica's fault that they... It's not. No, so we wanted to kind of, in our own small way, redress the balance. Yeah. And let you know, I mean, if you've never heard Orion before, it's a fantastic piece of music. It's also, it's, it's almost a metal symphony, isn't it? It's like a classical so, yeah. piece of music. It's, it's... Just listen to it. It's it's my favourite Metallica track ever. Nothing will ever replace it. For me, it's perfect. And I know you love it as well, don't you? Yeah. Yeah. Right, everybody, enjoy. Thank you so much for watching. Uh, please do take care. Look after yourselves. Two hearts, one love from Manchester. One love from Manchester. Take care. See you guys. Bye.